Hello and welcome, the Innate Gamer here with another Trading to Team with the Ramos episode. Um, there's so many episodes today because I've got an inset day from school and I really cannot be bothered to go out, so I'm just doing a bit of trading. And because in this series I show you everything I do, I like to be completely up to date, so I upload as I do it. So there are going to be a lot of episodes today, I think. So, you know, if you like that, you know, just watch them all. If you don't, you don't have to watch them, that's fine, I don't mind. I just like to have these episodes up, so if you do want to watch them, they'll be here. And so, this Quintero, I might win him for this. I Like I said in the last episode, do not get your hopes up, because you might not. Because, yeah, there's other people wanting to buy him. And so they'll be going, oh yeah, nobody's going to outbid me. I'm going to make so much profit. And then you don't, and it's a bit awkward. So, yes. So, striker, any formation. What's his lowest by now? Uh... Is there any for that? Oh god, there's one for 20, 20, 20. Yeah, 20k. 2500 is lowest. Ah, uh, make bid. 16,750. Oh yeah, that's right, that's right. <laughs> awkward. That would have been really awkward, wouldn't it? <laughs> Just accidentally bid like 30k, like, oops. Oopsie daisies. Okay, so somebody will be bid on one second. No, they won't. Very nice. So, 451. Uh, let's have a look. I might do lowest, or I may do um, lowest by formation, or I might just do general lowest. I'm not sure. It just depends on on the market. See, there's no like buy nows for four 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 five one, but it's lowest by now. Is there any for like twenty? Any? Is there any for like twenty k? Um, in a thing? No. So I could list him for 20k, and he'll probably sell, and that would give me uh, 2,250 coins. Or I could, I'll list him for like 22, because if you want him in 451, you'll buy him in 451, if that makes sense. So we'll just list him for that. We can always lower him, because for that price I got him for, there's always going to be profit, you know? So I don't have to worry about it. Uh, let's have a look. So we've got Marcus Asensal, probably going to lose money. Probably going to make money. A uh, bit of a gamble. Bit of a gamble, I suppose, along with this one. Should make money. Will make money. Uh, will make money, hopefully, if that makes... Makes a bit of sense. So what else can we do? Who should we look for now? Let's go. Where should we go? Hmm. Let's look. I'm gonna go Liga BBVA Silvers. And there's a Brazilian. Is it right back? Is it the Brazil? Uh, I mean Liga BBVA. Uh, Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Montoya. What the hell? Oh, Cicinho, Yes. Oh, and he plays for. I assume Seville. Is that Sevilla? Seville. Yes. I. I be right. And I assume he's the only one. Uh, let's go to. So his lowest by now is about, what, 14k? 14k? Is that his lowest by now? So we've got 14, 14. So we pick him up for below 14. We're probably, you know, in for that profit. 13, 5, no, 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 no. I'm not feeling these guys, to be honest. I'm not, I'm not happy bidding on those, because I don't think there's much profit to be had there. Oh, sorry guys, I just yawned. <laughs> oh well, so let's have a look. So these guys, I need to look at his price. What's his buy now? Because I think he's in the current team of the week, so he's only going to get cheaper. So I'd have to get rid of him, like, really as quickly as possible. Because, you know, there'll be no profit otherwise. Uh, what else? What else can we do? Uh, so, oh no, right back. What, not the Seville FC, what about the FC Barcelona one? What's his lowest by now, like, 4k? 3k? Is it 3k? No, okay, so is it, like, 4k? 3.9, no. Ooh, let's keep going. Because I'm going to do a bit of mass bidding, you know, silvers today in this episode, me think. So I bid on a bunch of silvers. And hopefully I make that profit from them. 424. Four. So about 4k he's the lowest, you know. So 
will be, I don't know, about three, three and a half, 3,500, what have we got, no, yeah, there's no point, oh, this is annoying, I'll add him to watch list in case I happen to be trading at the time and he's, you know, going for cheap, uh, who can we go for now, everyone, everyone's being bid on, hmm, let's go centre mid, I'm going to have a look at some Quinteros. Oh, no. No, I'm not. I'm going to go BPL. We can go back to gold. We're going to go gold. Uh, CDM, maybe. And we're going to go QPR. Who I'm looking for is Mr. Adele Tarat. Because he sells very quickly, usually, in that position. In a CDM. Is there any for under, like, 9k? No. Okay, so... 10k... 10 to 50, so about 9 9 is his lowest. Has he been price fixed by Strootmeisters? No, they're just listing him for the same. Does nobody bid, like, put their cost a little bit, like 9 8, so it's likely to sell? Because in my mind, that's, you know, just a simple thing to do. You lose 100 coins, but it sells quicker, so, you know, in my mind, wow, there's none on bid. How about in centre mid? What are we talking in centre mid? What we be talking centre midfield? <laughs> Informed to rap, there we are. He's probably quite a good deal, but I can't afford him. Unfortunately, uh, so what's his lowest by now? And that one's like 10k maybe. About 10k, 9.8. So is he that one a really good deal, or is that just a you know average deal? Uh 10.5, 9.8. So 9.8 is his lowest. So below like. 95 what have we got 9500 there should hopefully be a few add to watch list no 13 hours screw screw that man we're not doing that okay what other center mid center mid frank lampard maybe uh chelsea center mid frank lampard how much is center mid frank lampard center mid frankie Oh, 9.5, that might be a deal to have had. Look at that inform. I might I need to pick up some informs soon to trade with, not just randomly picking up informs. Uh, so, what's his lowest by now? Like 10k. He looks like quite a good, quite a good centre mid with 87 shot and all that good stuff. It's about 11k. So, wait, so what is his lowest? Where does he start to get common? You need to find the details of exactly where he becomes, like, used fairly often. So, at 10 to 50, mine would be... Ooh, 10 to 50, mine would be, like, second cheapest, third cheapest. So, that one is not profit. But if we look in 442, because formation affects price, you know? If we look in 442... No... No, 12k, about 11.5, so there's no point really, to be honest, there's no point being anything, so about 10 to 50 is his lowest, so let's look at all right, all right, 9k probably, 9k is where we'll start getting profit, so we'll add to watch list, uh, uh, I don't know if I want to, Add to watch this. What other CDM? So now let's have a look at uh, Spurs. We'll have a look at Parker. Mr. Parker. Feel it. No, oh, no, that'll bring all. Oh, what other cams are there? Maybe like a matter. What about Chelsea? Spain. This is what I mean. You just got to look for loads of players until eventually you find some that there's profit to be had, you know? That's the main thing I would suggest to you. So in a centre mid, what's he got? He got like 27,000. There's, there's a Fernando Torres, wow. <laughs> wow, that's uh, interesting. Who the hell puts Fernando Torres centre mid? 29k. No, I'm not going to do that. 29k, so can we pick any up for like 27 under or under no i do not want bloody fernando torres 
Uh, yeah, there's no real profit. What's he worth in cam? So, he's about 29. So, what's he worth in cam? What'd he be worth in cam? In, say, uh, 17k. Oh, 2,700. Let's keep an eye on that one. So what's he worth in... Let's do a bit of just normal trading, maybe. So, 27k. Oh, there's loads. That's not what I meant. I meant, like, 19k. There's a few. Why is there so many Torres in, like, obscure position? Uh, just Fernando Torres as well. Just random ones, just chilling there. Uh, 17k, that's not the one I want to talk about, this one that I want. So, auction search, how about like 20k, 18,750? There's a bunch for like 18k, so that one, no profit. Remove from watch. We no happy make profit from you. This one, also not profit, I just kind of had him in the old watch list. Okay, so there's going to be some mad bidding war for this matter. I'm yawning again, I must be so tired. Come on. So, you know, this will probably end the video, just me me hoping to win this guy, and that will be this episode. So let's see if we can win him. Come on, we can do this. So a minute 20. I don't know if uh, I'll be outbid. Well, I'll obviously be outbid, but if I can win him for a profit is what I actually mean. I'm just randomly saying things, apparently. What can we do? Okay, a minute. Hmm. I hope I can win him for maybe, I don't know, 15k. Oh my god, someone's, someone's keen for that. They've jumped straight in there with that bid. Haven't they? I've never used Matter. Is he any good? I don't know. Leave it in the comments if he is good. I'd like to know because I might pick him up using myself. Because he looks like he's got really good, you know, dribbling, pace, passing, shot, you know. Looks a good all-round player, to be honest. Oh. Hmm. Do I still want him? If I can pick him up, I'll go max 16k. I'll go max 16k. Because for matter, I guarantee there'll be people who actually want to use him, you know. So, yeah, we're not going to get involved. So, that's it for this episode. If you have enjoyed it, please do drop us a like. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you all next time.